so many items in short supply tonight. We are talking about skyrocketing demand for outdoor gear, which has impacted camping stores all across the world and those right here. Good evening. We begin tonight with another fallout from the pandemic. The rise in popularity began last year when pretty much everyone was looking for a socially distanced hobby. A year later, demand still high, but the supply has yet to catch up. Bikes, kayaks, tents, you name it. Our Joey Prechtel looked into the shortage and Joey, the weather's getting nicer and that apparently is only adding to that demand. Yeah, Mark, it's especially important right now to be ready with Memorial Day just a little more than a month away. People really want to start planning out those summer activities now and try to stock up on all the supplies that they'll possibly need. Otherwise, if people wait until the week of that big trip, well, those outdoor shops may be out of what you're looking for. All around town, people are, are struggling to get what they need. Carl Reed is the bike shop manager for McHugh Sports in Boise, and he's seen the impacts the pandemic has had on the outdoor gear industry. It's been impacted in a lot of different ways. Let's start with mountain bikes, which are going to be a tough find this year. If we've got it on the floor in your size, you should probably buy a lottery ticket because it's your lucky day. There are a lot of different reasons why your ideal purchase may not be readily available for the summer. Everything, most of the stuff gets brought over by boat from wherever it's made and there's just not enough boats to, to get all the stuff to the country. This is Chris Hownold, president of Idaho Mountain Touring. He also says mountain bikes are the hot ticket item. Normally they come to the store in a box and the bike gets assembled before it hits the floor. Now, you know, the demand is high enough that they go from the box to somebody's hand. That's not all that's impacted. Just about anything uh, to do what I call human powered outdoor activities. From tents, sleeping bags, camping stoves, fuel and bike safety gear. The earlier you kind of plan for that, the better chance you'll have of getting all your stuff together and having a great trip. Another big item in big demand, car racks. That's the only one we have. This one you see on camera and by now it may be gone. They go out almost as fast as we get them in. So the best thing to do right now is plan. Plan out almost everything because the sooner you do, the better chance you have of getting it. If you're just sort of shopping and looking for what you might want, there's a good chance you're going to miss out on it again until 2022. And it's not just affecting those two stores either. I also called REI, Cabela's, as well as Boise Gear Collective. And all of the managers that I talked to said that they have plenty of items that are in short supply and high demand. They also said that if you're out shopping in any outdoor store and you come across something that you're actually looking for, that you actually need to get ready for the summer, then buy it right then and there. You don't want to wait on it. You don't want to uh, lose out on it. Otherwise, someone else might come in and buy it. And another tip is to just be flexible when you're going out shopping. Maybe you're looking for a specific item and instead of that specific item, that store has something close to it. Just so just be aware of that. Try to have an open mind is what the managers tell me and always be aware that that other thing you're looking for may also just be a little bit more expensive as well. Back to you. Yeah, the bikes are crazy. I ordered mine a month ago and it no sign of when it's going to get here. It's nuts. Joey Prechtel reporting live for us tonight. Yeah. Joey, thanks. Yeah.